back to you guys again. What we're gonna do right here, right now, we're gonna just show you guys how to do the demonstration on doing the compound. Okay, but before we do that, I just want to thank my sponsors and stuff like that. Before we go any further, Marlon Celestine, Anton Hudson, Sean Wetters, you guys know what you did. Thank you. All right. Always before you do anything, safety first. Safety goggles, glove. First, we're going to start with our compound. Always want to put a nice thin layer of compound, okay, and just spread it out, even and smooth. Always just take a look and see how the compound machine is going one direction. You always want to keep it in one direction, okay? Because what we're doing, we're heating up the clear coat and just spreading it out really, really thin, okay? We're reheating the clear coat with the compound machine. That's what it's really doing. Heating it up, spreading it out nice and thin.
in just a little bit close to Mr. Cameraman. Just take a look at it. Nice and smooth. You see the, the swarm marks we have there from the compound machine? This is why we have to use the machine glaze. The machine glaze is going to take that out and also just add a little bit more protection for the paint. All right, for the water, the sun is going to give it a little UV protection. Okay, so step two now. Change your pad, machine glaze pad. All we need is a tin layer, again, easy and simple. For us professionals, please, leave this for the professional, please. Same direction, the same way you go with your compound, the, the, the heavy compound pad, the same way you go with the same direction, okay? professional a true professional always leave this up to the professionals please okay and there you have it and also just to give you a quick demo on how it would be after a rainfall you see how the water just sheets right off now that's protection right there The water just comes right off. All right? And if you take a walk with me around the car, we did the entire car the same way. Okay? The entire car was sanded, buffed, and what you can do after this, maybe after 10, 15 days, you can put a nice wax over it with your hands and stuff like that. We're not going to go that far, you know, because what we did basically really protected. This is going to last you from now 
until the next summer. Okay? Keep it clean. Keep it away from the birds. Always keep it away from the birds. All right? And also, I'm going to say it again. Leave it for the professionals. Ideal consultants, hit us up, like us, tell us what you think. Don't forget, we are now on uh, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram.